It's time for Donkey of the Day. Donkey of the Day, ask Charlemagne. I'm a Democrat, so being Donkey of the Day is a little bit of a mixed place. So like a donkey. Yeehaw. Okay. Donkey of the Day. <laughs> the Breakfast Club, bitches. Now, I've been called a lot in my 23 years, but Donkey of the Day is a new one. Yes, donkey of the day for Wednesday, October 19th goes to an ex-con named Richard Springer. Now, let's start this donkey of the day off by using a, a, one of black feminist Twitter's favorite words and saying Richard Springer is trash, okay? In fact, he's the most trash Springer of all time, which is saying a lot since we live in a world where trash TV like Jerry Springer has reigned supreme for a long time. But Jerry Springer is good garbage. Richard Springer is just trash, scum of the earth. One of those people that you look at and... You know, you look at him and his life and you say to yourself, most lives matter. The reason I say most is because I really don't see any reason why Richard Springer is here. Now, Richard is a career criminal, 16 busts dating back to 2003 for various robberies and assaults. And as of yesterday, they are still looking for Richard because of his latest victim. See, Richard decided to go into a deli at around 8 a.m. in the morning and argue with a store employee over the price of a Bud Light Straw Burrito. Drop one of Clues Bombs for Bud Light Straw Burrito. Okay, <laughs> the, malt, the beverage of thoughts everywhere, all right? The straw burrito was $3.50. All Richard Springer had was a dollar. So instead of getting a cardboard sign and writing, why lie, I need money for a straw burrito on it, he decided to slam the dollar on the floor and bail out the door. When the deli worker went to get the dollar, uh, Richard Springer trash ass threatened to kill someone, then came back and punched the deli worker in the face. Mm -mm -mm. Now, the deli worker was 18. I'm telling you he was 18 because I want to show you the wide demographic Richard Springer reaches with his fist, okay? Because after he punched the 18-year-old, he stormed out the store and he punched a sweet church-going 69-year-old woman named Eve Gentelian in the face. Now, Eve was just walking by. Oh. She was coming from church, going to the supermarket, probably to pick up something for Sunday dinner. Oh, damn. And this, you see the video? The I'm watching vi it The now. video's on revolt right now. This trash-ass individual punched her in the face. This poor grandmother's legs mm. stiffened, and she kneeled over and hit the back mm. of her head on the pavement. Terrible. And she needed emergency surgery after suffering a brain hemorrhage. Now, Richard oh Springer gosh. is 28 years old. I don't know if he's in custody yet he's on the front or the, of the new york daily news with the headline open season on the elderly uh i would like anybody out there who knows this man or knows where he is there's absolutely no reason for him not to be in custody right now do not aid and abet this fool this man cares nothing about his own life that's why he doesn't care about the life of others any man that will punch a 69 mm -mm. year old woman in the face with no remorse will absolutely punch you your kids your pets mm -hmm. these are the people whose lives don't matter don't protect mm. this man get him off the streets before the next person he hurts is you or somebody you love give richard springer's trash ass the biggest he hard please <laughs> By the way, this is the sixth senior citizen attack since August 30th in New York. Uh, assaults have risen across yeah, the city. I've been city. hearing about That's it. That's so cowardly, by the way. Yes. I've been hearing about Disgusting. it. Disgusting. How would you... Mm. Go ahead. No, I'm just saying if that was one yeah. of my family members, I would go crazy. That is definitely cowardly. Yeah, no, assaults have risen, ac risen across the city on victims 65 plus, and everybody out there attacking old people, y'all are complete suckers, and you all should be euthanized. And I don't feel comfortable saying all lives matter when there's people out here that are beating up senior citizens, okay? Because their life don't matter. Damn it. Black lives matter and then most <sighs> lives matter. I'm watching this now. That's just... Oh, I can't even... I'm not even watching. My goodness. All I'm right. The Breakfast Club.